Now, let's go with problem number three on your springs. So, problem number three. Compute the maximum deflection of a 22 coils helical spring having a load of 120 kilograms. The spring is squared and ground ends. Ibig sabihin yung active coils natin equal to the number of total coils minus 2. With modulus of elasticity of here, in here is 80 GPA, so that is E, outside diameter of 8 cm and wide diameter 8 mm. So, pwede natin makuha yung number of active coils, so that is 22 minus 2. That is 20 coils. Now, hanapin naman natin yung C. Ano ba yung dito? Maximum deflection, that is 8. F, C cube, N, A over D, D. Meron ang si F, si C makukuha natin, si A nakuha, si G, D. Okay, hanapin mo natin si C. Outside diameter ng D, O minus D over D. Kaya convert na natin si 8 cm to mm. So that is 8 mm minus 8 mm divided by 8 mm. minus 8 by 8 that is 9 ating spring index so pwede ba natin masolve yes, yung reflection that is 8, yung F is 120 kg 120 multiply na lang natin ng 98.81 para maging newton. And then, multiply na natin si C ng 9 cube. And then, multiply natin ng 20 active coil. Alagay doon, masolve na natin. Divide both sides by divide both sides by 80 GPA. So, 80 times 10 to the 3 newton per millimeter square. GPA times wire diameter na 8 mm. Okay, so, ang matitira lang dyan is 1. So, may natirang isang mm, cancel to. So, the deflection in mm is 8 times 120 times 9.81 times 9 cube times 20. Divide natin ng 8 times 80, 10 to the 10. The answer will be 214.5447M. So, napakadali lang ng spring. Pag alam mo yung formula. Ganun naman sa machine design, madali siya pag alam mo yung formula. Empirical man or drivable. For number 4, So, for number 4, the load on a helical spring is 1,600 pounds or uh, 1,600 pounds and the corresponding deflection is 4 inch. The GDT modulus is 11 million PSI and the maximum intensity of the safe torsional stress is 60,000 PSI. Design the spring for the total number of turns. For the total number of coils, okay, if the wire is circular in cross section with a diameter of 5 8 inch, 5 8 inch, yung wire, ha, yung tinutukoy na dito yung wire, and the center line radius of 1 and a half inches, the spring is squared in ground. So, yung number of active coils equal to number of total coils minus 2. Okay, ang binigay sa'yo dyan is uh, yung deflection. By formula, titignan natin, shearing stress, 8 AFC over pi d squared. Okay? Tapos yung deflection, that is 8 F C cube N A over GD. Ano ba yung 
ano ba yung formula dyan na meron kang number of coils? So, ito. Ito lang gagamitin natin. Hindi natin gagamitin to Okay? So, meron kang deflection daw ng 4 inch. Tapos, 8. Yung force is 1,600 pounds. And then, C. Alam ba natin yung C? Meron kang center line radius dyan na 1 and a half. So, 1.5 times 2 divided by dm na yan, center, center line radius, ibig sabihin dm. And then, ang iyong wire diameter is 5 eighths cube, na hanapin natin, okay? Na. And then, divide both sides by, divide all by gd, that is, ang binigay niya is 11 million ata. Yun, 11 million pesos. 11 times 10 to the 6 pounds per square inch. Tapos ang wire diameter is 5 inch. So, cancel all the same units. Inch, 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 inch. <coughs> How's my inch ka rin dito? So, NA will be B4 times 11 times 10 to the 6 multiplied by 5 eighths divided by 8 times 1,600 tapos 1.5 times 2 divided by 5 eighths cube meron pa ba? wala na so we can now solve for the total or for the total number of active coils so for times 11, 10 to the 6th, times uh, 5 eighths, tapos 8 times 1 6 multiplied by 1.5 times 2 is 3, obviously, tapos ito is 5 eighths, And then cube. The answer will be 19.42. 19.42669. Coil. So, okay. Yung NA pa lang yan. Wala pa yung number of total coil. So, NP will be equal to 2 plus NA. Okay. So, plus 2 na lang tayo dyan. 21.42. 21.42669 Okay, paano mo sabihin yan? Round up mo ba to the nearest uh, decimal? To the nearest whole number? Or ilaround up mo up? So, tignan natin kung ilaround up natin siya ng 21 or 20. We have to choose between yung pinakamataas at yung pinakamataas. So, 22 point. Always yung pinakamataas, magpapasobra kapag-design. And uh, let's proceed with the natin.